Okay guys, today's video, kind of a review. We've owned this stove for three years. We bought the stove, microwave, refrigerator, dishwasher. Um, uh, for the last three years, we haven't been anywhere. We have no vacations, no nothing. We use this thing every single day. We rarely eat out. Um, even when we days when we do have takeout, uh, we still use the stove um, consistently, whether it be for breakfast or lunch or dinner. Uh, we used this stove for three straight years and as you guys can see uh, still in fairly good condition this is been killing me guys replacing this panel i use some of this easy off oven cleaner guys um, to get the stove clean you kind of got a lot of grease everywhere um, and i let it sit and i use one of these opposed to opposed to one of these and the paint just start peeling and you guys can see the handle has not uh, stood the test of time i'm going to replace the handle but we're going to replace this panel because it's killing me and the knobs they broke all off these are we got all new aftermarket knobs even though this is not the original uh ones that were on here as far as color wise this is the black stainless steel these were the ones that was available so i bought all new of these and they have the metal insert inside of here opposed to just being a plastic housing how can i zoom in so this is metal opposed to being plastic when the other ones would break off so this is a metal now so these are durable more durable than the standard so this is the first change all new knobs because the other ones uh were horrible after about a year um another thing it was a little burn we got a little burn mark here but other than that we still left the plastic on the stove as well as refrigerator um the plastic on the screen is still here but uh the stove uh, let me show you guys the back of the stove just clean it out moves back and forth easily Got these beautiful floors. I got a video on my channel for these floors. These are the best floors ever made by man. Um, these floors are amazing. I got three little boys and they drag their cars on them and not one scratch on these floors. And I put these down three years ago as well. I got a video on my channel for that. As well as the install of this uh, stove and this refrigerator and the dishwasher. So the dishwasher is okay. Refrigerator, we got a little spot here. That's it so far. After three years, but I got three little boys, man. They they rough, but um, that's the little, uh, the only situation with the refrigerator. But the stove, there's some. You can see the starting to peel, the whatever material they're using to coat this. Like I said, this is a black stainless, supposed to be black stainless. Um, the microwave is okay, but the handle has the same. It's doing the same thing as the stove. You guys can see right there. It's doing the same thing. So, probably going to place this handle out. I can deal with these little marks on the oven door. Just want to replace this out. We already start removing screws here. Here, they fill up screws. But we got these four. And we got these two. So, we're going to take those out right now. And by me having a new piece, I can tell you exactly how to remove it or install it because it shows me all the screws are and there's retainers here and here we're gonna get that off but i um, gotta clean it some more too look at that I still got grease here so let's pop this piece off real quick so here's the new piece
These are all the same screws. You don't have to worry about nothing. They're all Phillips screws. Same size screws. So we use this, just want to push in here. Adjacent to this burner, just want to push in pretty thin. I'll show you guys what this is. I bought a set of these. Just push in here. Same thing here, come push in and push back. So as you can see, we got a fill up here, fill up there. Everything looks good and everything looks really good. If you guys notice, I didn't unplug it. You don't have to unplug it. You don't have to unplug it. Left the power on. It's not going to do anything. These. Remember it was in the first slot. So what number three? Although there are more holes on there, but just only three. There's one here, one here, and one there. Okay guys, got some grease here and there, but give me a little time to clean around these plastic pieces best I can. Get this grease off. Uh, I think I'm looking real good. So I'm gonna clean up right now, clean all this up. These are the screws that came out of the front, but we're gonna use the shiny screws. We'll use the shiny screws and put these in the bottom of that panel. We'll use these at the bottom. So we put the shiny, the shiny screws with the new panel. But it looks really good besides the little grease as expected. Um, like I say, if I'm comparing this to a car, guys, I work on cars a lot. I work on everything, but I work on cars a lot, lot. And Bass Band is brand new three years ago. I would say, uh, comparing it to like brand new car three years ago, this stove has about 300,000 miles on it. If this was a car, we use it every single day since uh, I installed it. We even used it that day. <laughs> so, uh, uh, I guess you couldn't get a better review than this or, or what to expect if, from heavy use. But as far as the cosmetics or how it looks aesthetically, uh, it works amazing. No complaints whatsoever. The oven, everything works amazing. Oh, I love this stove. Wish it just wouldn't be pillowed. Guys, I unplugged the oven because these are uh, electrical connections. I don't want to damage anything by getting wet. Just using some hot water and a little bit of oven cleaner. I bought these from Dollar Tree and I'll show you guys for $1.25 for like a six pack. And these are pretty good. Talk to the garage and I cleaned it up super good.
part I had should have came with these retaining clips, but they're easy to remove. I'm squeeze in. Can turn them like so. Clean these off. I use my new DeWalt, has different torque settings. Very good. So much better guys, so much better. 